Hey guys, in today's video, we cover best Nespresso machines based on extensive research and testing. Here are a few options that will meet the needs of different types of buyers. Whether it's price or performance, we have got you covered for more information on these products. In the description box below, I have included links that are updated for the best prices. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's get started. Here is number 3. Nespresso Pixie by Crumps If you are tightly restricted on countertop space, then the Nespresso Pixie by Crumps is the answer to your single-serve coffee wishes. On test, our reviewers found that the Pixie was very easy to use and offered a hassle-free way of making a morning coffee. It took on average 20 to 30 seconds to preheat and an espresso took just 15 seconds to pour. We were really impressed with the thick creamer that the machine consistently produced too, which resulted in a coffee tasting neither burnt or overly bitter. A favorite feature of ours on the Nespresso Pixie is that upon removing the drip tray. It reveals an integrated bin for 10 used capsules. It's easily removed for emptying and cleaning. Additional cleaning is occasionally required to rinse the bin and drip tray, but that's about it, so there is not too much washing by hands to do. Although, it would be useful if you could pop the puts into the dishwasher. As with all coffee makers, a descale will be required to help maintain the machine after every thousand capsules. Let's talk about number 2. Nespresso Gran Latissima Coffee and Espresso Machine The Gran Latissimas takes Nespresso's signature one-touch brewing to the next level by offering an impressive nine drink options. Users can select a shot of espresso in three different sizes or several milk-based drinks like lattes, cappuccinos, latte macchiatos, and flat whites. After testing the machine firsthand, our reviewers praised its versatility and added that it's easy to tell what drink you are choosing because of the label buttons and LED display. Another benefit of the Gran Latissima is how quickly it brews. This is true for most Nespresso makers, but the speed is especially notable here considering the variety and complexity of drink options. It took just 20 seconds for an espresso shot and 50 seconds for a cappuccino in our testing process. We also found its heat up time, second fastest out of the 11 machines we tested. Once finished with the coffee, clean up is simple thanks to the item self-cleaning function which forces steam and hot water through the milk spout. Nespresso recommends using the cleaning function after every use. The rapid cappuccino system requires a little more upkeep, however, instructions say to remove it from the machine, disassemble its six parts and place them in the dishwasher or hand wash them. Some users report that the milk spout drips for a while after use, but we didn't come across this issue in our tests. One last detail to consider in the Grand Latissimus price. It's more expensive than most Nespresso machines. Not to mention that Nespresso capsules themselves are pricey. But we think the convenience and versatility make it worth the money for those interested in a long-term top-of-the-line coffee maker. We are moving to number 1. Nespresso Virtuo Plus Nespresso Virtuo Plus is my top choice for a Nespresso machine. It has a slick and round design that fits well into any kitchen without using much space. This espresso machine has a monitorized lid that opens the machine's head where you insert the pot. You don't need a lot of strength to push the lid open, which is easier than the other Nespresso coffee makers. Just gently push the lever to the lid to go up or press down to close. Another feature that made this machine a top choice for me is the 4D OZ adjustable water tank. The tank rotates to the side or the back of the machine, so it's easy to fit the device anywhere. Virtual Plus has a decent used capsule container. It fits 10 used capsules. Another nice thing about Virtual Plus and all virtual options is the capsule's injection system that slides the pod into the container where you open the lid. You don't have to take out the hot pod when the machine is done brewing. You can take the pods out and recycle them once the container is full. Finally, Virtual Plus needs about 30 seconds to heat up 
and it brews a coffee drink in 25 seconds, so you don't have to wait for more than a minute for your drink. Here are the best Nespresso machines on the market today. Look for the links in the description box below if there's another product on the market or if you found one worth your purchase. Let us know in the comment section if you'd like to see a future review. Also subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon so you'll know when we upload new videos. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time on the Valid Picks channel.